Boradar, good morning. Tata Steel is set to formally announce plans that will lead to around 3,000 job losses, many of which will be in South Wales. Now, as the community around Port Talbot braces itself for an announcement of further job losses, there's concern about the impact on the town. And a man who's measured rainfall at the same location on Anglesey for 75 years has received an award for his Time for a look at the weather forecast now. Sabrina's here and has all the details. How's it looking out there? Thanks, Lily. Good morning. Go That's all for now. We'll have your next update in around half an hour's time. See you then. Take care. Bye-bye. Time now for a roundup of the week's news with Tony Evans. Coming up on tonight's programme, we'll be back live in Port Albert with the news as we have it. The still Time now for a look at the weather forecast. Derek's here. How's it looking out there? Lily. Thanks for your company this lunchtime. We'll be back with Wales today at 6.30 with the latest live from Port Albert. I hope you can join us then. Take care. Bye-bye.